Hello and welcome Taurus. I hope you're doing well. Let's take a look at your cards and the messages the divine would like to bring through for you. Be sure to connect with your heart, with your intuition throughout the reading. This is how spirit speaks directly to you and your situation. Just take what resonates and leave what doesn't resonate. Let's take a look at your first message here. Okay, so first of all, I'm seeing that there's a map and I do feel there may be a relocation or someone coming to you from afar. You may be planning travel. I'm also seeing that you're planning your next step. This is your world and you're planning your next step in a venture in your life. It might be in your work life or your or your life in some way, you're planning the next step. The individual epitomizes the universe, is the message. Where exactly does your influence on life end? You'll never know the full power or consequences of your actions and choices. Enhance the whole of life today through your actions. So this message is calling you to be aware of your actions, to be aware of how they might influence your life and others' lives. And um, this is going to be very powerful to do. There might be something going on in your life at the moment. I feel that there's something happening where there's a choice that you're going to be making soon and it really will make a difference to your life in a positive way it has that potential so focusing on the influence of your choices and then the consequences is what spirit is asking of you in silence we most readily preserve our integrity so silence meditation connecting into self connecting into your heart your soul thrives on silence. Maybe there's a lot going on. Maybe there's a lot of busyness. Maybe you're needing to take time uh, just to connect with yourself. From deep inside, you receive your most certain guidance and instruction. In silence, you are without distractions. This is why we fear silence. We fear its power. And there is immense power in silence, in alone time. Enjoy quiet meditation today. Meditation may resonate for you. It might be something that you are doing as a practice or, you know, it might be a, an urge that you're wanting to pursue and, and the divine is encouraging that. Life is a circle from childhood to childhood. There is a connection here that you have with someone. You're holding hands again. So there's a reconnection that's happening. You're, it might be a friend. It might be someone from the past. Um, this might also mean if it's not someone from the past coming through, this is a new friendship or this is a new partner. This is a new unity um, with someone here. Childhood to childhood means a spiral of new beginnings. So maybe new relationships. Relationships begin anew every day. Give your attention today to renewing your relationship, initiating another spiral of life into life into a life that you share with someone. So yeah, there's a relationship coming into focus or a reconnection. Speak or act with the negativity and pain follows. Speak or act with a pure heart and happiness follows. Being aware of your what you're saying and how that is affecting yourself and others and how it's influencing your life. Be mindful of being positive in all you say and do. Know that each of your thoughts and deeds has the power to heal you and those around you. So watch them closely without judging. Watch your thoughts and then watch what you are saying and your communication without judgment, but being mindful of it. Let's see what this deck reveals for you. Guidance for Taurus, please. Guidance for Taurus. And again, we have this connection, a friendship, a union, a bond that you have, a reconnection, someone new coming into your life, which is a gift 
Hmm. Maybe romantic doesn't have to be though. But this is uh, the message here is about deep love and soul connection. So definitely a soul connection with a particular person. I welcome healthy and heartfelt relationships. So if you hold that intention of a heartfelt relationship, it will be on the way. It will help bring that through more readily to you. Love and romance are all around you. So definitely love and romance is coming up on the cards for someone. I love and appreciate myself is the message. At last, a suddenly soaring success. You're about to take off. This is a big win. This is big success for you. You're about to launch. This is you launching something in your life. You're launching off a often and, and taking flight it's beautiful and I see a lot of happiness here you're ready for this you've never been this happy you are moving into success into victory um yeah taking off my life and I it's my life and I choose to shine is the affirmation stride into a dreamt future with graceful purpose my soul is at ease and love fills my heart. So having confidence, taking big strides ahead, you're taking off, you're launching, uh, you're going to the next level. So we have that same symbolism here with this card, similar to this, um, you know, at last you're soaring, you're, you're flying, you're, 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 you're doing it. Okay. So place that energy and that message in the area of life that fits for you, Taurus. There's a lot of happiness here. There's a lot of um, a lot of a lot of joy, a lot of satisfaction and contentment that I see coming through. Yes, another message of you are about to shine. You, it's it's your time. You're about to shine. So this might be speaking to a situation where you haven't been luminous. You've been suppressed in some way, or there might be doubt that's crept into your mind and kind of kept you quiet or kept you not fulfilling a purpose. But you are about to shine now. You're about to come out into the light. You're about to um, be recognized. Self-worth, love, value, and respect. Yes, yeah, so there's a lot of confidence and a lot of contentment with yourself. Beautiful. Master manifester. Yes, yeah, so um, this, uh, this, this lift off, this going to the next level is definitely something you have prayed upon, something you have intended, something you have hoped would come into your life. And it is happening now or in the next few weeks, just trust the process. You might just be a seedling at the moment in some way. Um, you know, symbolically what that represents for you, Taurus, but there is a, there is growth that's going to happen and that needs to happen, but you are about to take off. You're about to, um, about to launch in some way and have a lot of confidence around that. Have a lot of confidence. Maybe you are gaining confidence, Weave your destiny. So something's happening right now that is destiny for you. It has been destined to happen. And that's, you know, that's just it. There's destiny behind it. Seek the wisdom of your shamanic guides. So this is about seeking the wisdom of your angels, of God, of source, energy, um, prayer, meditation, connection in with intention is what I'm seeing there. That will bring peace and harmony and guidance to you. Embrace enlightenment. So enlightenment, of course, means a reveal. There's definitely going to be a reveal of something that may be hidden or just not you're not aware of it. It comes to light and you're going to embrace this awareness. I might come through communication with someone and, you know, you find out some things. A new door is opening. Step over the threshold. This is a call to action. The, the, the divine wants you to open a new door, wants you to go down a new path. That means a new opportunity is on the way for you. It means that there, that option is going to be there for you, Taurus. Beautiful. But you get to choose to step over the threshold. You get to choose to move down this path. 
Six of fire, success, holding up the wand of victory. There's recognition here again. So we have this, you're about to shine, success, there's recognition, there's reward for effort and self-esteem and confidence. So very, um, very similar messages coming through here seems to be a theme for you at the moment. The two of earth balance. Yes, you might feel like you're kind of um, balancing something at the moment. You need to prioritize. You need to make sure that you're prioritizing what you need to at the moment and not procrastinating or being distracted. Being more playful is going to be helpful for you as well. And this energy of prioritizing and playfulness will bring this relief of negativity and worry, maybe sleeplessness, um, anxiety, and we'll bring through this um, success, this lift off and this uh, self-esteem and confidence. There is news or message coming through that might be of a creative nature. You are going to feel more enthusiastic and passionate about your life in a, in a certain way, and you're going to feel more motivated. But there is a message here that might be coming through about work or your job or something that you are focusing on intently at the moment, something that you're um, doing day to day, maybe a routine thing. The Hermit is, is a Virgo's card, so you may have a Virgo in your life of importance, introspection, self-discovery, mentorship. So there's definitely a um, a need here to go within that meditation or that reflection on your heart and your true desires. This can mean a retreat. It might mean going away, doing something solo um, and taking time for you without distraction. The aid of water. So this does symbolize walking away from a situation, seeking fulfillment. You're searching for a way forward. You're going to find it. Your angels are guiding you in the right direction and there is empowerment in this. Beautiful energy coming through for you, Taurus. I hope you've enjoyed the reading. Take care, stay blessed, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.